Try there we go. It. Three. Oh, I could hide neath the wing of the bluebird as she sings. I've been singing my entire life. I know uh, back when I was a little kid, my dad used to sing my sister and me to bed with things like, He stopped loving her today. They placed a wreath upon his door. Or he'd sing a little Simon and Garfunkel. Slow down, you move too fast. You got to make the morning last. Just kicking down the cobblestones. Looking for fun and feeling groovy. When I was a little kid, I used to actually stutter and shit. <laughs> well, let's... Oh, I could hide neath the wings of the bluebird as she sings. The six o'clock alarm would never ring. Hi, my name's Dave Lewis. I'm 39 years old, and I live, currently live in Birmingham, Alabama with my wife Donna. You could say I've been singing my entire life. My dad used to sing me and my sister to sleep with songs like, Hello, darling. Nice to see you. It's been a long time. You're just as lovely as you used to be. Or he might do a little Simon and Garfunkel. Slow down. You move too fast. You got to make the morning last just kicking down the cobblestones. Looking for fun and feeling groovy. Now, when I was a little kid, I used to hate doing reports because I would stutter. And I figured out if I sang the report, then I didn't stutter anymore. I know my first report I did by singing it was in third grade, and it was a song called Water Pollution. We have got to fight water pollution. I think we'll find that's a solution. It is ugly. It is trash. You will never, never, never make any cash. Now I'm fighting water pollution. Now I've got the secret solution to fight. Now, 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 water pollution. So I, in the 70s, I li mainly listened to stadium rock bands like Journey. I thought Steve Perry had the best voice I'd ever heard in my life back then. And Dennis DeYoung from Styx. He sang, Babe, I'm leaving. I must be on my way. The time is drawing near. And Boston, they would do uh, more than a feeling. When I hear that old song, babe, more than a feeling. I think you're dreaming. Then when I got into the 80s, I sang more, I got more into alternative music like The Cure. Show me, show me, show me how you do that trick. The one that makes me scream, she said. The one that makes me laugh, she said. Threw her arms around my neck. And I do, uh, I used to love U2. That was my first concert, was U2 War. Sunday, bloody Sunday. Sunday, bloody Sunday. And I also liked Motley Crue. Uh, tonight, tonight, I'm on my way. I'm on my way home, sweet home. Yeah, I'm on my way. Just set me free, home, sweet home. Then in the 90s, I got more into, oh, I was in college, so I did more Jimmy Buffett. Oh, let's see. Wasting away again in Margaritaville Searching for my lost shaker of salt And I even got into some Garth Brooks You know a dream is like a river Ever changing as it flows And a dreamer's just a vessel That must follow where it goes Trying to learn from what's behind him And never knowing what's in store Makes each day a constant battle just to stay between the shores. And I used to love James Taylor. I still like James Taylor. Oh, I've seen fire and I've seen rain. I've seen sunny days that I thought would never end. I've seen lonely times when I could not find a friend. But I always thought that I'd see you again. 
So basically, I guess you could say that music has been a huge part of my life, and that's a good reason I think I'd make a good contestant on Don't Forget the Lyrics. I even met my wife through singing. As a matter of fact, that's the reason I started with uh, Daydream Believer by the Monkees. I met her in a bar, and I was singing Daydream Believer by the Monkees, and I did it like this. Cheer up, sleepy Jean. Oh, what can it mean? To a daydream believer and a homecoming queen. And my wife is going to be one of my supporters. She's probably going to be one of my backup people. And also my sister-in-law. And either my sister-in-law or my sister. So uh, I'd love to be a contestant. I love Wayne Brady when he did the uh, thing on Dave Chappelle where it was like the training day takeoff. That was really cool. And uh, I'd love to be a contestant. Have a good day. Thanks.